there are a number of other changes which unite the Eutherian or placental mammals. Some of these are features of the skeletal system. So, for example, in Eutherian mammals, the temporal bone is larger, and in the majority, develops an auditory bulla which surrounds the tiny auditory ossicles of the middle ear. Some of the changes which unite Eutherian mammals involve the reproductive system, such as the reduction of the cloaca so that it is only retained as the vestibule in females, the change of the glans penis so that it is no longer forked as in marsupials, and early in Eutherian lineages, the descent of the testes into the scrotum, which is a feature in males in most but not all Eutherian mammals alive today. Eutherian mammals share many features of their brains, primarily involving the great increase in the size of the cerebrum. Eutherians connect the two cerebral hemispheres using a corpus callosum, and the expansion of the cerebrum ends the midbrain exposure, which allowed the midbrain to be visible on the dorsal surface of the brain. Many areas of the brain are shared among eutherians so that they do similar processing in similar areas. Eutherians increased the ability to manage fine skilled movements. Eutherians moved the hippocampus. And eutherians share a number of folds in the cerebrum. There are a number of features of the cardiovascular system which are shared in eutherians. So, for example, the sinus venosus is retained only as the SA node after embryonic development. The embryonic lateral abdominal veins become umbilical veins. In many eutherians, there is only one superior vena cava after embryonic development. There were duplications in the globin genes. These and other changes evolved in the ancestors of eutherians and are shared among the modern eutherian or placental mammals today.